to my channel. So today's video is going to be a bit of a haul from Jo Malone. A few of these items I got for my birthday and a few I purchased myself, but I thought I'd put them all together in one video because I really love Jo Malone products. I've been purchasing from there for quite a number of years and um, pretty much running low on a few items. So it was pretty good timing. Um, I was just setting up filming and we actually got a bit of a mini special guest just behind me. My little fur baby Molly, just here. Um, I mean, of all the places that she could sit and chill out, she feels the need to chill out just here. So, <laughs> we'll see how this goes. Um, if you hear purring and random noises, it, it's her, not me. What I'll do is, um, I'll open up each of the boxes individually. We'll go through this bag first. I can't remember what's in what bag, because um, all the same, pretty much. Um, but we'll just kind of open everything up. Again, I'm a sucker for packaging. I love Jo Malone packaging. Um, it's gorgeous, very um, minimal, simplistic, quite chic. Um, so we'll just open this one. Again, I can't remember actually what's in this one. So we'll see. Oops. So what we've got is, again, they always come in gorgeous boxes. Um, anything that you get from Jo Malone. Um, and really nice and you can reuse. So we will just see what is in this one. Ah, yeah, so this is the 30ml Peony and Blush Suede Cologne. Um, I really love this size of Jo Malone items, if you could just see that. I'll also put a picture in the corner as well, just so you can see it a bit better. They're really good for handbag sizes. They do come in 100ml, um, but I find them quite cumbersome and quite heavy if I'm traveling. Um, I usually keep the 100 mils at home and then have the 30 mils out with me. And Peony and Blush Suede is like one of the most popular fragrances they do. It's, oh, it's so gorgeous, it's so fresh as well. And I love floral um, scents anyway. So that's really nice. Again, I'll put the details in the description bar of all the items that I've got if you wanted to purchase. Um, so that's really nice. And again, love the packaging. Then uh, let's go with, what should we do? What do you think, Molly? You're not that first, which one I go with? We'll go with this one next. She's happily um, chilling. <laughs> hey, Babs, you all right? Just leave her to it. Um, so this is the next one. Uh, we'll just give this one a bit of an unbox. Um, so let's have a look. So a few of these items are, I got myself uh, and a few I, I did get as gifts for my birthday recently. So, which is always nice. People know that I like Jo Malone. So the next box. Oh, and on this one, um, sometimes when you'll go to Jo Malone, which is a really sweet thing, they'll give you little samples, um, which again are great for your handbag. And I've got two samples um, of lime, basil and mandarin. You um, probably can't see, but just little minis. So again, really nice for your handbag. And they'll quite often put those in your bag. And one lovely little touch as well, they usually spray the um, paper as well with a nice fragrance. So slightly bigger box this time, which is really nice, quite heavy. Open this one up and this one is 100 mil and it's the English Pear and Freesia cologne so this is the biggest size they do in the cologne um, again I'll put a picture in the corner just so you can see it a bit better um, and I've had these fragrances before over the years um, and I currently had I think the Honeysuckle and Divana that I'm running out of um, so I thought I'd try one of the other fragrances I've not had for a while. And this is just gorgeous, summery, fresh, super floral, really, really nice. Um, so definitely recommend that and very kind of elegant packaging. But I generally keep the 100 mils at home. They are very weighty and a glass bottle. So um, very nice. Then let's open this box. So again, same packaging. Let's give this one a um, bit of an opening. Still surprised Madam is fast asleep. 
this is rare. She's like the noisiest verbal cat ever. Um, but again, she's just chilling. It's a hard life being a cat. So, another little, little mini box. So again, just there. And this is the another 30 mil. And this is Nectarine Blossom and Honey. Now, I've not had a bottle of this before um, compared to the two. Um, so I thought I'd give it a try. And also, if I'm not quite sure, um, I'll usually get the 30 mil um, just in case and just see what it's like on me. But oh, it's got a bit of a sticky on, on the um, top. So there we are. Lovely. This one's very, you can really tell the nectarine, probably more so than the honey, I would say. Um, I'll put a picture in the corner as well for a better vi visual. Um, but it is quite strong, I would say. You can really, really smell the nectarine. So if you're not a big fan of nectarine, you may not like this one. Uh, whereas the two are a little bit more delicate in um, scent. But no, really nice. Another good handbag size. Then... So what we've got, we've got just a hundred mil of English pear. We've got the Nectarine Blossom and Honey in 30 mil and the Peony and Blush Suede, 30 mil. And then just a couple of these little samples I'll just put there. And then in the large, oh, quite heavy bag, just here, um, we will open the last box up. So... Got. It's quite a big box. Let's see if I can get it out. Here we are. So again, this is slightly different. It's a black box and um, white ribbon, cream ribbon. And just open this one up. Try not to drop it. And you will see this is a 200 gram candle which is the blackberry and bay this is their kind of home range and if you're familiar with my channel i love love candles i go through candles quite regularly at the house um and again i'm running low um and i don't think i've had the blackberry and bay candle before um i've had the i think i've had the cologne before but yeah not the candle so i thought i'd give it a try and it's got a nice metal lid um it's glass again so it's actually quite heavy um, again, I'll put a picture in the corner just to give you a bit more of a uh, visual. Um, but let's have a bit of a smell. So, just take the lid off. So, it's just a one wick candle. Oh, you can really smell the blackberry and the bay in this. Um, they do do larger candles. They do little travel ones. Um, but I think the largest they do is 600 gram, which is, I think, maybe a three wick candle. But I quite like the 200 mil, especially where I put them. They're not too uh, big for the apartment, but no, really nice. Really, really like the smell. It's actually quite relaxing, um, chilled smell as well. It's not too intense, but really, really nice. So that's nice. And I love the little metal lids that come with as well, and the little bow. So um, all in all, We've got the candle. We've got the 100ml um, English Pear and Freesia. And then we've got two of the 30ml. Uh, one is the Nectarine Blossom and Honey, and one is the Peony Blush Suede, which is gorgeous. So I am well and truly stocked upon Jay Malone. This should last me, I mean, the candle probably won't be la last that long because I go through candles quite a lot. Um, and actually the 100ml cologne will probably last me a good six months or so. Um, but yeah, I'll be making the most of the 30 mils for sure. Uh, but I do love Jo Malone. It's, if you're not familiar with the brand, I would recommend them. Um, whether it's the candles, the colognes, they do like lotions, they do hair mists. Um, I even think they do like home sprays as well. Uh, but I particularly like the candles and the colognes. They do do an intense range of colognes as well, which are like black bottles. Um, if I've got an image, I'll put an example in the corner. They're very intense. They're a little bit more pricey. 
Um, and the theory is, is that they're more intense, they last longer. But me personally, I actually prefer the non uh, tense range, intense range. Um, I prefer these, uh, but personal preference really. Um, but no, really, really nice. Really glad I've got a bit more of a stock up on some perfumes. There's a few other brands I want to get as well in the coming weeks. Um, and if I've got a chance, I'll do a video on those as well. So pretty much all in all, I'm, I'm happy with the items I've got. Um, I love the fragrances. It'd be great if you guys could let me know any recommendations you've got on scents that you've used with Jo Malone, because there are quite a variety and I'm kind of working my way through them. Um, and also if you're new to my channel as well, it is quite a new channel. So any kind of support you guys can give, if you wanted to click the subscription button below, and also if you want to get notified of when my uploads go live, um, just click the notification button. Um, but, you know, any kind of comments and likes is really great for my new channel. I really appreciate it. Um, so we'll see if my little fur baby is waking. Hello, Babs. Want to say goodbye to the viewers? Hey? She's like, not really. I just want to chill on the sofa. Hey? Yeah? Say bye. We'll say bye. Bye to the channel. Bye to the viewers. Hey? Bye-bye. Yeah. No, she's not too bothered. <laughs> so I'll leave her to relax. Um, I'm going to put one of my candles on. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.